I transform the regular London bus into a five star restaurant but why? Because as some of you guys know I'm running for London Mayor and we've already polled in at 5%. We're currently fifth place in this election and we've only been campaigning for two weeks. We are genuinely making an impact and we need to take it to the next level. So let me tell you about something called stop and search. Stop and search is when a police officer can stop and search you if they have reasonable grounds except the numbers aren't reasonable. You're nine times more likely to be stopped and searched in London if you're black and I'm sure we can all agree that's outrageous. But a London under me won't target anyone unfairly. Currently in London you get stopped and searched. But now you're paying to be stopped and served. So we've set up a London bus which will stop and serve people and this will be done by my friends at the Windrush Bar and Grill. And they're gonna be making the food. Now as I'm running for London Mayor, I can't give this stuff away for free as that would be bribery. So people are gonna have to pay for the experience. So just because of that, we're gonna have to make sure it's extra special. And that's where we need another bus. This bus is gonna be a five-star restaurant. It's gonna be driving around London and providing people with a visual experience. And last but not least, a three course meal all for five pound and that's a bargain if you ask me enjoy a luxurious rooftop pent bus experience exclusively with the ndl welcome to stop and serve london's first five-star bus restaurant let's go We've got our bus driver here, Big Barry, and he's, uh, he's ready to take off. So we've got to get our, our first few customers for the journey. As this is my city, it's my job to make sure I know everyone. But even though I knew everyone's names, nobody seemed interested. Peter! Peter! I need you on the bus. No, thank you. Bobby, Stacey and Melanie. No, thank you. This is Sharkeisha. We basically... Sharkeisha? Yeah. Your friend, we know each other. What's your name? It's Justice. Okay, Justice, please. Have some justice. I am sure ju someone join your will name. help you out. There's no justice in this just justice. Can't be me. I'm absolutely devastated. Justice had no justice. We need more justice in this world, and that will only come if you like the video right now. If you don't like the video, you are racist. That's right, I don't make the rules. You should probably like the video right now, and you better subscribe. But back to the video, we were actually getting somewhere. You need to be my first customer. I love that smile, that cheeky I smile. Can't walk Take a look at this. Stop and serve. You were born to be on this bus. You're so stylish that we need you on this bus. Come up, my friend. What's your name? Chris. You are our first customer, Chris. Thank well you. done, how'd you feel? I feel great. Who are you voting for, for London Mayor, by the way? Nico. Yes, Nico. Right, of course, that's who we're voting for. Stacy Stacey and Tyrone. Listen, guys. Tyrone. Delicious food. The yeah. best food in London. I mean, that sounds fine. Yeah. Come through! Great news! I see you smoking crack there. I hope you're enjoying it. But I need you to stop smoking crack and start eating some really nice snacks. The bus started filling up and we were ready to get things started. Throughout the day, we actually managed to do two bus journeys with two great groups of people. But let's not waste any more time. Let's get this show on the road, ladies and gentlemen. Woo. Welcome to the Five Star Restaurant. This is arguably the biggest moment of all of your lives. You're about to be on the Five Star, the first in the world Five Star Restaurant bus. Chris, you're our first customer, all right? Hey, so man. I'm, I'm going to be looking man. out for you, all right, my guy? Big up, my lads. And um, Tyrone and Claire, really enjoy your journey, all right? It's a, it's a romantic date. It's actually a work meet so... Oh, a work meet up? Oh, I'm so sorry. I apologise. We won't push that storyline anymore. This was it. The bus looked incredible and we were ready to stop and serve. Literally, the moment the bus got moving, people wanted to get on board. Have you got five pound? Hop on, hop on, hop on. One sec, Barry, we got someone hopping it. Barry, Barry! Run, 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 run on the bus. And she made it. And she ran it. And she ran it. Where did she make it? You made it! Yay! She made it! One person getting on then inspired a city to hop on and join us. People were literally sprinting through London to make it. Some people even snaked their own family. Oh no, the dad in the box has been left! You left your dad! Hey, get off the bus! Go back to your dad! Respect your parents! Get off! Shame on you! I'm so bad they left their dad. It's usually the other way around. With that being said, the bus was well and truly up and running, catching the eyes of everyone. And on board, we were spreading the movement. Vote for Nico! Or you're a pussy! Let's go! But stop! It's time for the first course. We had a wide range of starters. 
olives. But it was time to focus on the young couple at the front, Tyrone and Claire. Do we have any toothpicks? Oh yeah, yeah, there's toothpicks yeah. in here, go on. Oh, look at that. Ladies and gentlemen, romance isn't dead. This bus is bringing the best out of people. I love young love. Okay, let me just leave you both to it. <laughs> Okay, hopefully by the end of this they say I love you. That's the aim. For those who ate the olives, they seem to enjoy them, which is quite surprising because personally I think olives are awful. A posh man's grape. How the hell do they even qualify as being a fruit? Yo, you're, you're literally serving this to people and making them pay for it. Relax. Yeah, you're right to be honest. I better like calm down. Yeah, probably. Well, the horrific odour coming from our olives caused such a scene that more people were coming on board the bus to check it out. You in the house! Come out! Come out! Join us on the bus! We'll drop you off on the bus! It's calm! Run down there quickly! Hey! Hey! Look! 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 Welcome! Food! Food! Yeah! Join us! This lady left her house to join us on our journey. That's special. She told us she was from overseas, so we had to fill her in on what was going on in this city. So if you're from Germany, all you need to know is I'm the mayor of this city. Okay, but I know who the mayor of London is. Who? Not you. Who is it? I don't know his name. But... It's me. That's me. So what went through your mind when you saw us from your window? I thought it was a school trip. How dare you? It's not a class. <laughs> We're serious people with a serious cause. We're all from different backgrounds, as you can see. And we, but we all are behind the same course. Are you now part of the course? I am. Another member to the NDL has been added. Time for some more campaigning. Vote for Nico. What, are you going for? what am I going for? I don't know, to be honest. <laughs> but please, please vote for me. It's vital. My magic words have inspired the people. I have their respect, so in return, I showed that same respect to the people. Ladies and gentlemen, you're looking at the future mayor of London. All you guys are eating at some Knacks restaurant. And we're eating on a five-star London bus. Shame on you. You're down there in that knackered restaurant. What's it called? Doom Bar? Dry place. Big up. Vote for Nico, though. But before we go into the mains, I wanted to sightsee with everyone. Show them the sights of London on the bus. And let them know what the locals are saying. All right, guys, just before we give out the main courses, please, everyone, just take a seat. Uh, uh, look at the people sitting over there, yeah? You see the man with the stripy hood. That right there, he's the local nonce. Hello, my friend. He's confirmed voting for Sean Bailey. Nice to see you, my friend. Vote Nico. Please keep him away from the children, the, the man over there. There's the children in the basement. He'll, he'll capitalize on that. Now, if you all look at the man over there with the umbrella, he's actually married to his sister. Yes, hi. Thumbs up, yeah. Yeah, that's him. As you can see, yeah, that's confirmed. Guaranteed. Big up to you, man. Legend, yes, yes. Yes, he is a literal incest man. I guarantee Love you, man. Guys, right there, it's the local drug dealer. He's carrying eight pounds of crack. Oh, sorry for baiting you out. Sorry, man. I apologize. Well, I guess it's time for the mains. We actually had a wide selection for the mains. Legit this time. And I was there taking everyone's orders. But in my eyes, two people were my priority. Look each other in the eyes and tell each other how you actually feel about each other. I feel like you're a good product manager. Um, and with the right support you'll get there. I'll forever blame you for bringing me on this bus. Oh, yeah, fine. <laughs> That's how she feels. <laughs> A little bit of flirty banner there. Yeah. All right, I'll, I'll leave you guys to it. As I left them to make love, it was time to let the people feast. The greatest food provided by the Windrush Bar and Grill. They said a five-star restaurant bus couldn't be done, but look at us now. Yeah, tell me who said that. Nobody said that. Are you ever going to give me a break, George? Please, just give me a break. No one said it. Well, okay, well, I'll tell you what they did say. They said the food was exquisite. Is it cool? What is it? It's nice. Say that one more time, but just say it's really hot and nice. Okay, it's really hot and delicious. I feel like it's the best jerk chicken I've had in like a long time. What would you rate out of five? Ten out of five. You can tell from the packaging, it is five star experience. So this is um, five star, 100%. Salute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a tender. Tender, that's what we like. No complaints. And everyone likes it, yeah? Yeah. If anyone leaves any negative reviews on Yelp or whatever, you are getting off the bus. There we go. I'm glad you all like the food, my friends. On this bus, you can do anything. You can eat the food, you can have a look at the amazing sights which we've got, and also, you can do work. You can do everything you want, because this is the five-star NDL bus restaurant experience. However, it was time to keep moving. Keep moving on, there was more stuff to be done, more sights to be seen. All right, Barry's off and running. Little girl, please ask your parents to vote for me. It's your future. Shout out, Starbucks. We all know what happened there. You have suffered for your sins, Starbucks. No one's waiting outside your store anymore. We continued through London. We saw the sights, Sight. the city, city, and the sky, oh. and nobody cared. We've 
had our mains now and everyone looks bored. Look at the boredom in everyone's faces. That's good boredom. They've all wasted their time on this bus. I don't know what they were expecting, to be honest. The five-star experience. How the hell can you have a five-star experience on a cold bus? But you can miss <laughs> yeah, yeah, I promise a lot of things. I'm a politician. I lie. That's the whole point of it. On that note, if you like the video right now and subscribe, you'll get a brand new car, a brand new house, and one million pounds. I promise. But back to the video, we had bus pirates take it over the ship. Help. Here comes the joke. Stop okay, take it off. Take it off. Listen, take it off. Barry, stop the bus. Get off. Get off. This is what happens to anyone who changes side. It's time to go. Everyone wave them off. Bye, mate. Bye. Get out of here, man. Now the dead weight was off the ship, it was time to hand out the treasure. It's dessert time, and we were handing out brownies and cookies for all. Can I trust you? Are these not spikes? Oh, They're not spiked. Lovely. Only what spiked with these? semen. You know what? Take it easy. Spiked with semen, and he takes three. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we like. When are you just going to admit to each other how you feel? We do love you. We've, we've both said it. We do yeah, love you. I think we both just fell in love with you. So it's like a three way thing you want. I mean, well, there's an app for that. Oh, it all makes sense now. No wonder he wasn't interested in his date because he wanted me and he can have me. As mayor, if he votes for me on May 6th, don't forget to vote. But I then offered his heartbroken girlfriend my BBC. Big baked cookie. Oh, the food was incredible. The only thing better was the experience of being on a five-star restaurant bus, which I can honestly say was once in a lifetime, for better or for worse. Look at this sign. Welcome to paradise. That's not paradise. Paradise is right here. Am I right, my people? Yeah. Yeah. I feel like they'll just gas me up for anything. NDL! Yeah. Yes! I bus people, you're Max! This is the best bus there is! Yeah. Yes! This guy needs to get on the bus. Oh, what the hell are you doing? <laughs> Boo! You suck! You suck! <laughs> it seems the naked cowboy didn't age well, but anyways, it was time for us to return back to the base. My friends! We're driving home now. Thank you all for joining this journey and giving me your money. Hopefully I can rely on all of your votes, except for yours. I don't know how you even managed to get back on the bus. You finessed us all. Stop, stop, stop. <laughs> start again, start again, start again. One more time, one more time, one more time. And the L! And the L! And the L! Let's go! And that is how I finessed the whole load of people into thinking this was a five-star restaurant. They really paid to be cramped on a bus in the cold. But look on the bright side, I'm rich off the people's money, which is what being a politician is all about. Hello, my people. We're home. Thank you, my friends, for being involved in the world's first five-star restaurant bus experience. You've been stopped and served. Thank you, guys. Peace out. Get off the bus now. My friends, we are making a change in London. Our message is spreading and it's only gonna get bigger. A London with me is a London for all. And with that being said, the next point on our manifesto is to introduce Stop and Serve. All proceeds from this bus have been matched by me and donated to the Forefront Project, who are a charity who aim at steering young people away from crime, which means a brighter future and more people for us to serve. If you like the content on this channel, you're gonna love the content that's gonna come out on the NDL channel. Subscribe to the home of the NDL now. It's in the description.